We're in Montefiorale, I'm just finishing up the wine tasting, and we're about to head back to San Donato and Colina. And it's going to be a slow afternoon for us. Yes. We've been going a lot, haven't we? Yeah, I really need some downtime. It's a little overwhelming being around this many you know, people in different places. Um, well, for two years we were so sequestered, yeah. really. And this is why we don't ever want to leave. Look at this place. <sighs> Time to enjoy this place a little bit. I was too busy cooking to get any videotape. After our visit to the winery, we both came back, kind of took a nice long shower to just kind of wind down after a lot of stuff going on. I cooked a little meal. Corey's opening wine to go with it because, well, you're in Chianti and wine is a part of that. Here's what we've got. We've got the cheeses that we bought at the store the other day, some crackers. We also have some bread. We have spaghetti carbonara that I made. Corey did some olive oil and balsamic for the cheese and bread. And the leftover Zuppa Toscana. And he's going to pour some wine and this is going to be our, our dinner tonight. And we're going to just be relaxing here in this beautiful villa. What do you think, babe? Sounds good to me. Yeah. Just you and me? Just me and you. This is probably what we enjoy most. I mean, there's restaurants all over the place. There's bars and all kinds of things we could be doing. But if we have our choice, cooking with local ingredients and making our own romantic meal. Look at this view that we have while we have our dinner. Why would you ever want to go anywhere else? Gorgeous. Always an adventure. Always.